Welcome, good people of the interwebs. I know, I know, I know, I've been doing live streams, but very little else. I'm sorry. And I didn't really want to do anything either, because I've had my fill talking about how we're being lied to about Corona. <laughs> we probably talk about it in the next live stream. I had my fill talking about the lies when it comes to climate change. Funny enough, now that everything has to be Corona, climate change doesn't really get any attention because, well, it's only bad as long as they can claim it's bad. But, I mean, what with most economies grinding to a halt. Mind you, not the Chinese economy, because that one's still going strong. But all Western economies are more or less grinding to a halt which means that's not a lot of transport, which means there shouldn't be a lot of CO2 being produced by transport. But then again, most of the CO2 that is produced is produced for energy, and people are at home watching telly or using the computer. I guess, I guess we're using more electricity now. I haven't looked into that. Interesting. But that's not what this video is going to be about. No, no, I've noticed that Trump is still fighting the election result and the more i read up on it and the more i hear about it the more i'm like it, it, it's amazing that he's still fighting i mean this should have been over with but in dutch we say amtelijke molens ma uh, malen langzaam which basically means um no i can't translate that maybe i should just leave it out i won't Basically, uh, people that work for government work very, very slowly. That's the rough. And let's be honest, I mean, it's, it's senators and governors and in the end judges that will need to do their job, and they do it ever so slowly. It, it's, it's amazing how many people keep telling us that there is no proof, no proof, nothing, except for all the things that are there. I mean, there have been people indicted with voting more than once. There have been dead people voting, but don't worry, they won't get indicted. Um, there have been disputable things done with the voting machines and votes came under tables after people sent away the, the poll watches. A lot of stuff. But if you point that out, you're worse than literally Hitler. And that's what I'm going to talk about today. Because, to me, it seems rather racist to blame that Hitler was a bad guy. I mean, Hitler, sure, why not? But in 2015, he, he won a seat in, 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 in uh, Oshana, Namibia. I think that's the city. And in uh, 2020, he, he, he kept his seat. And... I don't see what's wrong with that. I don't see why Hitler is so bad and everyone needs to be uh, put against the measurement of how bad Hitler is. I mean, yeah, sure, I don't know. He might kick his dog, I don't know. But he doesn't seem particularly evil to me, does he? I mean, yes, sure, he is a politician, but not all the politicians are bad. I said, hopefully, I assume he's just a nice guy. So, so what is it? All those people who claim that people are literally worse than Hitler. Oh, oh they must have meant this one. But, but he's been dead for a very long time, hasn't he? And, and, and this, this one is, is, is very much alive. So, oh, could it be that um, I don't understand which Hitler they mean? Or, or, or could it be, and this is very important to me, uh, this is all crap. I'm not going to read it all. Um, the link will be provided. But yeah, no, I mean, would it mean that if someone says you're literally worse than Hitler, does that mean that that they think that this black man is a bad person and I'm literally worse than this black man? Seems that way to me, doesn't it? Is it far-fetched? I don't think so, because he's actually alive. So why would you compare someone to someone who's gone, dead, committed suicide? You're literally worse than someone who committed suicide. Uh, uh, way of thinking of... I don't know. Anyway, as far as we know about 
Adolf Hitler, he basically did say he's, he's not going to try to rule the world or take it over by Krieg, uh, Blitzkrieg and all that. And um, I, guess, I guess it's a good time to stop calling people literally worse than Hitler because I don't know, I've, I haven't really heard him speak. And okay, this might not have been the most charitable pictures, but I don't think he's really that bad a guy. And, and he did get re-elected, so the, the constituents in his area might seem to think he's okay. So maybe we should just stop calling everyone literally worse than this guy, because he, he, what, what did he do? Come on.